Alberta, Canada. Let's go do some exploring. Today we're on our way to visit Lake Louise and Moraine Lake. I read that Lake Louise is one of Canada's most photographed glacial lakes, so I'm pretty excited to see it. We started out in Banff and hopped on the Trans-Canada Highway for 36 miles. I wanted to give you a good view of the road in case some of you are towing a trailer or driving an RV, plus it's just so scenic. You need to get an early start to get parking. As you can see, the signs said that parking was full when we got here, but we lucked out and we got a good parking spot. There is a shuttle you can take from Banff. The prices vary depending on the time of year. My first glimpse of Lake Louise, I was in awe. The water was just like glass. You can see Victoria Glacier straight ahead. At 1.2 miles long and a third of a mile wide, Lake Louise reaches a depth of 230 feet. Lake Louise was named after Princess Louise Caroline Alberta. She was the fourth daughter of Queen Victoria. The Fairmont Chateau Lake Louise is one of Canada's Grand Railway hotels. It was built by the Canadian Pacific Railway. This cottage on the grounds was built in 1920 as a home for Swiss guides to lead hotel guests safely up the mountains. The guides slept here until the last contract ended in 1954. Now we're taking the road 8.7 miles up to Moraine Lake. I snapped a picture of this sign on the way to Moraine Lake. I didn't think that the road was too bad. You can maybe judge for yourself by what you see in this video but there were buses and RVs that were going up on that road, so I think it's fine to drive. The parking was pretty full up here as well, but we found a spot without too much trouble. This is Moraine Lake Lodge. And I highly recommend coming up here to Moraine Lake. You'll see in a minute what I'm talking about. The color of Moraine Lake was even more blue than Lake Louise, if that was possible. It was more of a turquoise color. So, so pretty. Moraine Lake in Alberta, Canada. And yes, this is the real color of the lake. The color is due to the refraction of light off the rock flower from the glaciers that's continually being deposited in the lake. Moraine Lake is only 49 feet deep compared to Lake Louise at 230 feet deep. It's nicknamed the lake with the $20 view since it was featured on the backside of the 1969 and 1979 issues of the Canadian $20 bill. Moraine Lake's image is featured also on Google's operating system for Android. One of Windows 7 backgrounds in Being homepage. The lodge has a gift shop and a place where you can get a sandwich or snacks. Just spectacular. You just the pictures don't do it justice. I would say Lake Louise and Moraine Lake are on the top of our list of things to do here. If this is your first time watching my channel, click the subscribe button to see more of our travel videos and check out our Lake Louise gondola ride.